All right. The mad fellows. Uh, okay, that's a little on the louder side, but not too loud. Be adjust for myself, and I think it'll be all right. I think leaving that up since it's a music game, probably a good idea too. All right. Hey, there's a tutorial. Let's get tutored. Okay, so this is more... Oh, this is like... It's very, um... Guitaru Man. That we're trying to follow the lines. I'm not going to be good at that at all. But it's kind of Guitaru Man meets, um... Descent. Descent? No. Okay. Tempest, that's what I'm thinking. That initial spin gets me every time. Okay. Oh, we were one percent away from nice, but whatever. I like the little video, and then it shows you what's up. Okay, shooting is a little more like res. Shooting's a lot like res. This is cool. Conceptually. So shoot the little guys, then shoot the big guys. Oh, I'm, I'm not using the right stick, okay. Okay, so the stick auto locks. I was I was holding the uh, trigger for some reason. Some of the same fashion. What button should I be hitting? Oh, I see. You want to hit it when it's green. Cool. Got it. I like that they're also introducing like HUD elements one by one too. I'm probably going to play like a level or two with this. Oh, just missed. Oh, and obviously the more you hit green, the better your combo gets. So even if you turn the volume down, it still gives you like... Okay, that was a little confusing about last bit, whatever. Okay. Shoutouts to somebody advertising their Twitch channel on mine inadvertently. Okay, I like that following the line keeps you going through the obstacles automatically, too. I'm so bad at the first bits of those.
I love the gist of this though. Like they got, they, this is like such a good evolution of the Guitar Man formula. Start here by the base cannon, but I saw something off in the distance there. I don't know if I hit it. I don't think I knocked it out though. Probably like some weird secret. Yeah, but the Guitar Man meets Rez is not the thing I think I thought I needed in the world. But it's cool. Now they're gonna combine both. I got distracted, the photo sort of low. Got a little too, I can't tell if it was a little too fast or a little too slow, but. So there's a shift select too at the intro. I don't know if it just rewards certain gameplay styles with different multipliers or what. This is neat though. I'm glad I picked this up. Boss fighter just ending. Okay, exit. All right, we got an achievement for kicking it. Apparently, we kicked the we let the base cannon kick it. I'm definitely not bad on the enemies. Oh yeah, we'll do three levels, or if it doesn't let me unlock the third level, we'll do two levels. But putting aside the out the cup here, maybe get a little water. Okay, and the star outlines are the ones I got, it's not just a... Uh... How did you get a 78% but still made like 3 million points? I don't know, maybe, maybe again, maybe the, maybe the different ships, maybe, 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 maybe. Maybe, oh, maybe they hit those side bonus things that I noticed but didn't really shoot at. I feel like I've heard of Plux. Plux? I can't talk. All right, cool. We're at that point already. Plux Pavilion before. Noisia, I've definitely heard of. They did uh, some tracks for um, a couple of the Xbox DDRs. At least one of them. So it's cool that they like the, the, the this music has a pedigree. Ribbon's coming. Too. And I like that they're switching it up with the ribbons. It's easier to 
hard to keep on them, but it's cool. The vibration field feedback is really nice. I think you can adjust the intensity of that if you're not into the haptic stuff. I think that's technically haptic feedback. Oh, I should probably... Sorry, I'm easily distracted. I knew they were going to combine this stuff eventually, but... Challenge was... It just looks like red dots. I love these environmental obstacles too, because it's still they're still kind of the the, the beat too. It's... The complexity build is really nice. I guess there's no visual, actual visual indicator for... Oh, no, my butthole. Okay, oh, I see, I have, I have a number of lies, okay. Okay, yeah, DLC-wise, there's, uh, th I think, three or four ships, and, uh... Uh, what's the thing? Talking about yeah. Oh, two two song packs thus far. I uh, hopefully they got some more coming because this is good. Oh, we have to there. Oh, surprise walls. Oh. Oh, that's not good. Or is X for my multiplier? I guess. I I'm guessing dying nukes your multiplier. I probably shouldn't joke about nukes when a fucking idiot runs the United States and has access to those, but whatever. Yeah, man, I'm sort of getting the hang of this. Hello. Man, I'm not sure what shooting that col those columns does. neat though very chill too oh i see i see the shield icon now that's what that's probably my lives brightness okay so i guess there's an achievement for every song all enemies destroyed cool only three stars because i suck can we get one more song in i might actually just cut it there i feel like this deserves more of like a rhythm game kind of night um, apparently, oh wait, okay, it's like all my friends, I'm not on that, I'm definitely, I don't know who Musy Fops is, but I beat Jerry Hot Wheels at something, so that's cool, <laughs> no offense to Jerry Hot Wheels. It's chill out mode, oh that's, oh there's like a free play mode. Oh, I see. okay. The columns are the little dots. So it's like a secondary unlock thing. That's interesting. So yeah, I think all the ships are pay to add. I don't know if it's just aesthetic or if they actually have like in-game effects. I love the, just the scissoring. I mean, who doesn't love scissoring? Oh, they all look kind of like breathe a little bit. I guess they, I guess it happens, maybe I didn't notice it happens while you're like riding the ribbons or whatever. Maybe when you fire. Fire, I kind of like the, you know, look on that. That looks like a pod racer. 
And that looks, or no, which was the one? Oh, okay, the origin one is the one that actually, no. Did I not have that one? I thought I grabbed that one. Well, I still have a couple bucks, so I'll check the DLC thing and see what's up with that. In fact, I'll visit the store now. Cool, it's not capturing that, so. In library, in library, in library. Maybe it's not out yet. Yeah, interesting. Maybe there's a ship that's coming soon. That's cool. Huh. Interesting. Because I want that one. Those kind of guarantee that there's more DLC down the road, though. And yeah, it's just a very pretty, very chill game. I'm kind of curious if Madfellows have made anything else, but yeah, this is something like this is like i could do this casual streaming i keep saying i'm going to stream other days of the week that doesn't happen but if anything was to happen with it i'm kind of curious like i don't know if this it might be on xbox one maybe that's why the thing at microsoft maybe they got a few bucks that's fine gotta do what you gotta do all right reserved I guess technically this counts for broadcast. Oh, it even tells you what the music is. I love that it has all like the album art too. I'm guessing most of these are available on Bandcamp or somewhere else. Yeah, let's watch all the credits for all the songs we didn't play. Megalodon sounds familiar too. I probably have something about the prototype somewhere. Okay, so, oh, it's a, it's a program in England for, funded by Microsoft to help get more games out there. And again, proof that Unity don't judge just based on engines. Two people. Two, two person team. Not including the music. That's awesome. But I like that they let that linger so you can actually read it. for another couple of beats. There we go. Hey, I didn't realize it got kickstarted, but almost everything does anymore. That's not a diss. Like, it's good to see people putting money into things they want to see. Oh, and I guess these are the people who kickstarted hard enough to put some money in there. Anybody recognize? No. Anybody, anything offensive here? The yeah. end. I wonder if we get an achievement. I, I like, I'm, I'm big on achievements for watching credits just because, yep, there we go. Props. It, uh, you didn't see it on screen, but I did get one. Because, I mean, it sucks that you would have to encourage people to watch through the full credits with, you know, entice them with a. an achievement, but it's. A good way to get people to seriously watch the credits, which they should. 